I've got a bit of an issue with mystery boxes, especially PokeRev's mystery packs. PokeRev puts these up on his website and I just wanna buy them. In the past, I've gotten extremely lucky getting a silver tier and a gold tier in my last two videos. Check them out, I'll leave the links in the description. But with four more to open, are we gonna keep the streak up? Will we continue to get vintage packs or is this the end of the glory days? Let's find that out, but before we do, I actually came here from the future, that's why I look a little bit different, to tell you about, firstly, the giveaway I got going on. It's gonna be for a Charizard Ultra Premium Collection. One lucky winner, and if you wanna enter the giveaway, just subscribe to the channel. Hit the thumbs up button for this video. Lastly, comment down below, let me know what your favorite pool is that I get today. If you want to get a second entry and a better shot at winning, just keep on watching. I will let you know what to do later on. The second thing I want to tell you about is Kingdom Break number three. It is coming up on November 11th. This time it is Lost Thunder and Silver Tempest. That's actually the release date for Silver Tempest, and it's going to be freaking insane. Each buy-in gets you one Lost Origin pack and two Silver Tempest packs. You can buy in up to six times. There are a limited amount of spots available, so check out the link in the description as soon as possible to get yours. Last break, we did Roaring Skies and Evolving Skies, and it was freaking even better than Kingdom Break number one. I managed to pull a Moon Breon for somebody in the community as well as most of the top 10 cards from Roaring Skies. This time I want to do bigger and better. I'm going to put my fire hands and my plums to good use to pull you guys, hopefully, all of the Lugias in those two sets. Check it out. Links down below. All right, we got four of these. I actually got some extra ones so that I can do some uh, Insta Reels, YouTube Shorts, TikToks. You guys haven't yet. Oh, we got a red. That's cool. It's no gold or silver, but it's red. You guys haven't followed me on my new Instagram and TikTok that is especially catered toward Pokemon cards. You definitely should check it out. The link is in the description below. Your support means a lot. We got Astral Radiance, Fusion Strike, Chilling Rain, Lost Origin, and Vivid Voltage. These are fresh. Let's start out with Vivid Voltage. I've been pulling Chonkachu galore lately, but not the rainbow one yet. C-Dot, Electrike, Clefairy, Fanfy, Yan, Metagross, the Pikachu, just not the one I wanted. By the way, guys, you might be wondering, where's the code cards? I'm gonna do giveaways for those instead from now on. Some are going to be uh, sold and reinvested so I can afford to do all of these giveaways that I do, as well as uh, keep the shops, the rip and chip shop over on my Twitch channel, keep those prices down lower. Uh, so if you wanna enter the giveaway for a portion of these code cards, just let me know in your comment that you're interested in the code cards. That's literally all you gotta do. Dynamo and a Crabominable V. I didn't even know this was a card. Gotta say, we're starting off pretty decently strong here. We got Chilling Rain next, I think. Yes, we do. All right, we got Ralts, Castform, Steel, Aerocross, Atena, Reverse Quillfish. Holy shit, man. I love gold. And we got a gold water energy. You threw me off so hard, bro. That's a beautiful card. I'm like legally obliged to scream. I love gold. We are doing well, though. That's three for three so far. Will the streak continue? Or will it end with Puccina? Glammeow. Yanma. Swine up. Nick it in the butt. We got a Temple of Sinnoh. It keeps going, baby. We got the High Suian Decidueye Beast. We may have only gotten the red tier, which I've never gotten the red tier before. To be honest with you, I've only gotten the green, uh, which is like, you know, your sword and shield sets. I've only gotten the silver and then the gold, which are both more like vintage. So the uh, the red should be like, I don't know, like Sun and Moon era or something like that. Maybe even late XY, I don't know. Finian, Zorua, Paris, Inkay, Polyrath, Reverse. Oh, our streak ended. I don't like that. All right, we have the red pouch. What's on the inside? We actually can get some XY evolutions out of here. I hope that's what we have. Oh, we got some cosmic. I'll take cosmic. Yeah. I was just thinking today about how disappointed I am. Apparently, those Amazon uh, Arceus V-Star boxes that are like already kind of redundant, in my opinion, are even more redundant than you thought because they don't actually come with any cosmic, even though it shows it in the uh, the product image, which is a huge disappointment. We got Seal. Passimian, Rowlet, Lillipup, Skrelp, 
Nice looking reverse Pikachu and nothing behind it. That's a shame. All right, second mystery pack. We have a green this time. Very unfortunate. Battle Styles first. I really do genuinely like these. Uh, if I don't get a gold or a silver tier this time, I'll admit I'll be a little butt hurt. Just a little butt hurt. But uh, I don't know. I've been pretty lucky with these. Uh, my gosh. I mean, I just keep buying them when he puts them up, you know? We got nothing. Damn code cards. Fusion Strike. A lot of gorgeous cards in this set that just refuse to be pulled by any reasonable spending adult. Growlithe, Stuffle, Sigilith, Toxel, Totodile, Cursola. <laughs> Holy crap. Holy crap. Wow. And I just confirms it. I'm not a reasonable spending adult. I am an overspender. Look at this Celebi V Alt. What a absolutely gorgeous card. My god, it looks like it's a PSA 10. I don't know what these go for in PSA 10, but just the beauty of this card alone is worth me getting it graded. This is the second video in a row that I have pulled an alternate art out of one of PokéRev packs, so freaking amazing. I don't have that either, so I'm pretty freaking hyped about it, man. And the centering looks good. Not the most valuable alt, but wow, is it gorgeous. It really should be worth more, honestly, especially with the pull rates for that set. We have Teddy Ursa, Sneeze, Mistrevis, Barboach, Scyther, Granados, Marina. Chilling Rain, once again, no reasonable spending adult pulls all these alt darts. Am I right, fellow Americans? Is it going to work again when I say that out loud? We have Sobble, Bound Sweet, Furfro, Diglett, Larvesta, Frostless. <laughs> It didn't work again. Now, as for a set where no one reasonably pulls an alt art, you can pull an alt art out of this set. I pulled a bunch during the Rip and Chips uh, and a couple for myself. So Rip and Chips being for people in the community who buy into the breaks and such like that or buy into my shop. Check out the links in the description. Uh, but my God, is the quality control for this set terrible? No reasonable adult pulls a PSA 10 material. We got a Pikachu, look at the centering. And then a beautiful, look at the centering on this Pikachu. This is what I'm talking about right here. Like if you're fortunate enough to get one that was not cut by a spork and it appears that this one actually was cut with a real blade. Look at how off-centered it is. You just can't win lately with Pokemon. All right, and our mystery pack could probably be anything from the Sword and Shield era. I uh, haven't seen any evolving skies yet, have we? All right, and our mystery pack is another Lost Origin. Okay, no reasonable adult pulls a PSA 10 Jerry out of here, that's for sure. Let's let this knock over. Something. We have Meditite, or is this a Pika, or is that the code card? Shellos, Minefield, Litleo, Ghastly, Mr. Mime? <laughs> it was the code card. All right, next mystery pack, we've got Chilling Rain, Astral, Fusion Strike, Lost Origin, and Darkness Ablaze. To start off with the Darkness Ablaze, really just looking for that Charizard. I've already got it, actually. Honestly, possibly even PSA 10. I'm just not sure if it's worth getting graded. But it is what it is. The set has some cool stuff in it. Definitely not their best work, though. Rowlet Reverse and a Mimikyu. Non-hollow. Chilling Rain is up next. No reasonable adult can pull an alt dart from this set. Or <laughs> something like that. God, I want some alt darts from this set. Damn it. I've come to the conclusion that that was a one-time uh, <laughs> coincidence, I guess. Not like a repeatable uh, phenomenon or anything. They got Wooloo, Gassefle, Mudkip, Sandshrew, Cufant, Phalanx, nothing. I have a dangerously tall skyscraper of bulk to the right of me right now. I should probably stop the video to do something about that but it's too late i already opened a pack scyther growlith bronze or rufflet quillfish scyther nothing good lord lost origin man we need to get some more alts brother for sure we got a peeker pseudowoodo bronze or it's probably a regular v knowing this set Binacle, Gengar, and a four Drapion V, like the worst possible full art. Not my favorite thing in the world, but okay. Is it just me, or did I open all of that like really fast? We got a green one. It was a quick one right there, wasn't it? Jeez. On the inside of it's an Astral Radiance pack, not a single uh, Evolving Skies pack, man. So far, at least, but it'd be nice if we had something. All right, what do we got? Maybe a peeker, unless this is the cut of the cards. We got Togepi, Shadot, Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Magnemite, 
again. Is it the same one? Yep, it sure is. Drift Limb and a Hisuian Sneasler V. Okay, at least we got a hit. The last Poke Rev pack for today's video, and I did get some extra ones that I will open up uh, for like some YouTube shorts slash TikTok slash uh, reels, like I mentioned earlier. Uh, just trying to diversify a little bit, so definitely check out those channels, Instagram and TikTok. They're brand new. They are different than my main ones. It'd be cool if you could follow all of them. Hey, finally got some Evolving Skies out of this. Very cool. But yeah, I have a main TikTok and Insta, and then also one specifically for Pokemon for both platforms. Just trying to switch it up a bit, and I don't want to overload people that are just interested in Pokemon cards with uh, the variety of content that I have, you know? That's what I'm kind of trying to do. Make it a little niche. Pansier. Mine. Bulb Toy, Corsola, Quillfish, Shelmet, and a Hollow Steelix that I don't know if I've ever seen before. There's way too many cards in this set. Chillin' Rain. Come on, let's get an alt or something dope, man. I have uh, very few alts in this set. Would love to get uh, Moltres, Blaziken, perhaps. We got a Sandaconda, don't. VMAX, not bad. Astro Radiance, I'm still looking for the freaking Palkia, man. Quite a few Dialgas, two Machamps, no Palkias, uh, but I'll take any alt art from this set to be honest with you. I think I'm missing a couple of the other ones as well. Keldeo and nothing. Lost Origin. I didn't look at see uh, what the pack was, like the mystery pack yet, so hopefully it's like better than a green. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what we got. Rock off, but shop reverse and a hunch crow. I'm considering doing one last lost origin opening, or at least like one last big one. Calling it a day after that. If I can't get what I want, I'll have to just buy it from somebody. This is uh, Evolving Skies, Flabebe, Rog and Rolla, Psyduck, Swablu, C Dot, Scroll of Flying Dragon, Dracozolt V Max. Okay, at least we got a hit. All right, moment of truth. We have a red pack. Damn. Well, you know, honestly. What is it? One in five. We got two out of those out of our four here. That's pretty dope. And on the inside, it is a Burning Shadows pack, bro. Can we pull the freaking Charizard? If we pull the Charizard, I will lose my shit. All right, let's figure it out. We're going to do the pack trick for this, guys. We're doing the pack trick. We're going to milk the suspense for all that it's worth. We're going to get that code card out of here. I didn't even see... I don't know if they're labeled in such a way as to suggest one thing or another, but I didn't see it either way. Oh, the cuts on this look terrible, by the way. All right. Ah, I did the pack trick wrong. <laughs> I was like, what? How many did I go forward? Damn, nothing. Okay, we got a Venipede. Very anticlimactic. <laughs> well, shit. <laughs> All right, well, I screwed that up and it didn't even matter. We got Pikachu V. We got Crabominal. Sneasler. Dragazole VMAX, Sandaconda VMAX, Decidueye V-Star, a very off-center Pikachu, Trainer Gallery, and then a Drapion Full Art. We also got this very cool Water Energy Gold, amazing. And the highlight of today's video, not quite as amazing as what we got last time, but it is a Celebi V Alternate Art from Fusion Strike, and that is a gorgeous card that I did not have yet. If you want to get that second entry and a better shot at winning, just let me know what you think of the PokéRev Mystery Packs. Do you want me to keep buying them and keep doing videos of them? Yes or no? Answer that question, you'll have a second entry and a better shot at winning. But that's it for today, guys. I really do appreciate you watching. Don't forget I have a brand new TikTok and Instagram just for opening up some Pokémon packs. The videos are going to be the same as the ones I have here as shorts for YouTube. But if you want to follow me and check those videos out, the support means a lot. You can also follow me on Twitch. Link is down in the description for that as well. We do rip a shift once a week, usually on Saturdays. Otherwise, I do a bunch of gaming, Fortnite, Mario Kart, Animal Crossing, Pokemon games, Fall Guys, other things such as that. We have a great community. Come check us out sometime. We'd love to have you. Discord is available for you to join as well. Amazing community. And that's pretty much it, guys. Thank you so much. Stay amazing.